Hey guys, I'm going for another part of Team Deathmatch. Um, but before I do, um, I just want to say my deepest condolences to Cameron Boyce's family and rest in peace, Cameron. And me and my sister knew him on Jesse and the Descendants. Well, only one of the Descendants because I only watched one of them. My sister watched all of them, but. Um, He was a great little kid. I remember seeing a little tiny picture of him. That came to like Iron Man, I think. And now that he's grown up so fast, like he's already 20, already making, trying to make big changes for the world. He was a great dancer. He just had full of energy. But it's so sad to see that he has gone this young too. People are dying young this generation. And it's almost devastating because he had so much, he had a clever of things going for him. He just wanted the world to be better than what it already was. So that way the world wouldn't be so cruel. And now, now that he's gone, he has to keep his legacy alive. And it's crazy how so many talented, gifted artists, whether they're actors, rappers, singers, they, they their all lives were ended, like, <clears throat> we, we, we lost Mac Miller last year because of suicide, we lost Nipsey Hussle a few months ago because they didn't want to see us black people shine given back to the community and now you have a young boy Cameron who had so much going for the world died to natural causes epilepsy and I just don't see I just don't see why we're losing so many good people to other people's hands or, or naturally caused you know, and it just goes to show that we, we have to cherish everything that we have now. We have to stick to the present. We worry so much on the past and worry about the future and what it holds, then we're not living. We have to cherish everything we had, the families that we have now. I lost my uncle to cancer four years ago. Almost four years. It's not the 22nd one of December, but that's when he died. He died December 22nd, 2015, of cancer. And the last thing I regret is, the last thing was hearing his voice on the phone and that I had not had even gone to visit him the last time because I was so afraid. I didn't know at the time cancer wasn't a contagious thing. It just spreads all over inside the body. If I'd known that, I would have visited him that day. But all I could do is hear him on the phone. And that's all I could have done. And so, when it comes to death like this, even if it's from family, even if it's someone else, like a celebrity that you probably know or don't know personally, it's still sad to see a good human being dying from whatever. So, like I said, cherish what you have now before you lose it, because you never know. This world can be so unpredictable nowadays. 
especially when it comes to death. So, please, 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 cherish what you have now. And, and stop arguing with people, especially when it's online. Stop worrying about people that, that just doesn't give a damn about you. Live the life to your fullest, because you don't know when your own life is going to be gone either. Be satisfied with what you have, and stop worrying about what you don't have. Because there's so many people in the world that don't have what you have. That's why it comes to things like these. It, why does it, like, I wonder, like, why, why, why when it comes to death, people somehow come together? Why? Why don't we come together all the time? Just why? It only takes somebody dying for someone to say, we should, you know, come together. And it shouldn't have to be that way. Team match. Let's go. Rest in peace, Cameron. We know you're not gone. The blue team has scored for the first time. We know you're not gone at all. They were all on this side. Start throwing A's at them. This coming. Got my eight joined with me. to the end of my invincibility to see something. 
Come on, guys. Don't go that way. The blue team streak has just been put to an end. Reloading. Oh. Assist, bruh. Oh, gee, we're gonna die. Great. Yeah. You're about to win. Yeah, we the better, red man. team doesn't have a lot of time left. <laughs> Watch what they ass pop up. Cover me. They said the Oh my lord, why does he just stay up there? I was ignoring him. My bad. I'm not finna do any type of what legacy? I don't remember this. You trying to play? Nah, at least not classic. Not yet. I'm trying to think of a good time so that way these five matches don't put me back to crown one. Cause I would hate to be crown one. Maybe I should try to apologize to her. She didn't do anything, but still, I was pretty pissed off of him that somehow it reverted to her. She was a cool friend to have. I just hated how he was a coon about it. I had a good friend. I just wish it didn't have to turn out to be. I'll pick this up. Oh. First point for the red team. And we're gonna die. Oh my god. Yes. Okay. Oh, she got the computer. Wow. Wow, I didn't need I get that. <laughs> nice. I might use a red dot for all that. <laughs> I 
careful, mate. Cover me! <laughs> he said, and a rapist. That's too bad. Oh, shit. Somebody get Ed or Ray for this man. They're dead. I'm gonna skip this joint. How fast and I'm still here sitting around let's just hope she take care of that thing see I didn't I didn't even have to give her the she was gonna bound to get one anyway and it was a lot a lot sooner anyway you see guys see what she gets I don't even have my own computer at her age it only took a foundation to give me a computer now, if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't have a freaking laptop. I wouldn't have one. She would have been the only one having a laptop right there. And I would have nothing. You see? You see? That's why I don't share my shit. She gets everything. She goes, well, I don't get everything. Yeah, you do. To get everything all from family while I am left to get gifted by someone else that's not part of my family not biologically
Next thing you know, she's gonna have a switch before Team I match. do. Let's go. Why everybody just standing there? Fight, you idiot. You see where I'm coming from with this. The blue team has scored for the first time. Y'all see where I'm coming from with this. Killing say. spree for the blue team. See, this is the darker watch. My sister is disrespectful as she is. But when I somehow do it to her, she gonna be like, Tim, and Tim did this and that. Well, I wouldn't be that way if you would just hush up. But y'all, but you don't know how to be quiet half the time. I'm grateful, child. I'm sorry. Just been put to an end. Didn't mean to do that. Oh. Yeah, hit me. That's an asshole. <laughs> there are a bunch of bots. <laughs> the blue team streak has just been put to an end. Trying to get like eight kills. Hey, Nana, look out for your laptop, I think. Great. You're about to win. The blue team is heading to a perfect win. Yeah, these are definitely bots that we're messing with here. Because they don't shoot this bad. What the hell? to get the last one. Oh yeah, do you see what I'm talking about guys? This generation is absolutely disrespectful. And 
that's not I'm not saying that it is their own fault. It's just a lack of the other generation's ability to go ahead and and try to treat them right. Treat them the right way to act. Well no, my sister did not get enough of that. All she has been showered with a bunch of clothes and sometimes toys and then look at her. She she turns out to be disrespectful, she always reacting in her mouth. And then all of a sudden, mommy gets mad at me for overreacting. But how is how is that my fault, though? And my mother does the exact same thing. She says, I'm going to slap you and all this crap. Hush up, blah, blah, blah. And then she looks at me like, oh, you know what, Sharon, whatever. You see that? You see that? We're a hypocrite. Uh, and I want to tell her, if you want to slap her, then just, just do. Maybe it'll okay, actually so shut her look up. Look at my dog. Maybe it'll actually shut her up, because apparently hey, Max, I have to go. react, and all of a sudden you all, she all threatening me saying, "Oh, what are you doing? Just come on." Ah, she's brava. She's so brava. The blue team has scored for the first time. Haha! -ha. Now I hope I get the last kill. Oh, young duo, pretty mouth. You want to be here as duo? Watch out for the bomb! Bravo to do it. They shoot bomb, but they use the corner to gain the result. Oh, you know? Ah, so. Oh, What are you saying? Sit this to them. Damn it! Such a lying ass fucker. And they throw bombs like no other. I mean, just remember, it's some sad and bomb. Tinha matão, fosse chamar um piquetar. Não me deixou nada. Mal. E só não deu com a um. Então, tudo na bomba. Quando eu cheguei a dar com uma razão, eu tenho que escolher umas pibas, tá? Killing spree for the blue team. That would have been my chance, so that was too easy, trying to. They're not gonna win. So they can try and shoot me all they want. Get me up here. Ah. Oops, he didn't see me. The blue team streak has just been put to an end.
my god! Oh my gosh! Do I have to do this? Oh my gosh! <laughs> Cover me! And they still trying to throw bombs like that's gonna help. Over. See, they're throwing the bombs like that's gonna help. I swear to God. Damn. So they want to be bombers. Might as well, right? Oi, Dó. Oi, de Oi, de Pascaí, cara. Oh shit. They have to go down the side. Oh. Bunch of cowards. Killing spree for the red team. Never mind, let me not deal with him. He got two on him. Shit. On my tail, young. Yeah. Great, you're about to win. The oh, blue team them. is about to win. Yeah. Oh, well, he found that. Can't be that serious, yo.
Cat kills. Let's go. You either tell me if we're not going to win this. Oh no. We're trying to kill me like, no, I don't bet you tried it. <laughs> epic. Absolutely epic. <laughs> Let's go. I got the alpha and omega. I got the first kill and the last kill. Give me that shit. Yeah. Yes. Oh my god. I actually, actually did it. We actually did it. Anyways, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see y'all. Bye. Rest in peace, Cameron. We love you.